हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू योर ऑन यूट्यूब चैनल सेवन इंजीनियर डियर फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न क्वांटिटी कैलकुलेशन ऑफ स्टेयर केस बाय डिस्कसिंग अ प्रैक्टिकल प्रॉब्लम सो वॉच द वीडियो फुल एंड डू नॉट फॉरगेट टू लाइक दिस वीडियो लेट स्टार्ट टू दिस डिस्कशन टूडे वी हैव सेलेक्टेड अ प्रैक्टिकल स्टेयर केस हैविंग लेंथ ट्वेंटी फीट हाइट ऑफ द स्टेयर केस इज टेन फीट एंड लेंथ ऑफ द लैंडिंग इज फाइव फीट वेस्ट एंड लैंडिंग स्लेब थिकनेस इज सिक्स इंचज ट्रेड साइज इज ट्वेल्व इंचज ट्रेड इज द हरिजोंटल डिस्टेंस कॉर्ड बाई अ स्टेप एंड राइज इज द वर्टिकल डिस्टेंस कॉर्ड बाई द स्टेप विच इज इन दिस केस इज सिक्स इंचज आर पॉइंट फाइव फीट विथ ऑफ द स्टेयर इज फोर पॉइंट फाइव फीट here the concrete used for this staircase is 1 ratio 2 ratio 4 now to determine the quantity of concrete required for this staircase the length of the waste slab is needed here you can see that a right angle triangle is formed so by using pythagoras theorem we can determine the length of waste slab here the hypotenuse of the triangle is Length of the waste slab perpendicular is ten feet and base is twenty feet. According to Pythagoras theorem, hypotenuse square is equal to base square plus perpendicular square. So by using this equation, we will get length of waste slab is equal to under the root twenty square, which is the base of the triangle, plus ten square, which is the height or perpendicular of the triangle. so by doing simple calculation we will get length of waste slab is 22.36 feet now to determine the total quantity of concrete required for this stairs we will divide the staircase into three portion the first portion is waste slab the second portion is landing of the stairs and the third portion is steps so we will determine the quantity of each portion separately first we will calculate the volume or quantity of waste slab volume of waste slab is equal to length multiplied by width multiplied by thickness of the waste slab here we have to remind the length of waste slab in previous slide which is 22.36 feet width of the stairs is given in which is 4.5 feet the end thickness of waste slab is 6 inches or 0.5 feet after doing simple calculation we will get volume of waste slab is 50.31 cubic feet now we will determine volume of landing volume of landing is equal to length of landing multiplied by its width multiplied by its thickness here you can see that length is 5 feet width is 4.5 feet and the thickness is 6 inches or 0.5 feet after doing simple calculation we will get volume of landing is 11.25 cubic feet now we will determine the quantity or volume of steps for which first we will calculate number of steps to calculate total number of steps we will use this formula number of steps is equal to height divided by rise here you can see that height is 10 feet and rise is 6 inches or 0.5 feet so for values in this equation we will get number of steps is equal to 10 feet divided by 0.5 feet which gives us the value of 20 so here number of total steps are 20 now volume of each step is equal to cross sectional area multiplied by its width here you can see that steps is triangular so its cross sectional area will be equal to 1 over 2 into bh here base is equal to its thread and which is 12 inches or 1 feet and height is equal to its rise which is equal to 6 inches or 0.5 feet so area of the step will be 1 over 2 into 1 multiplied by 0.5 and width of the steps is 4.5 feet after doing simple calculation we will get volume of each step is 1.125 cubic feet now to determine volume of all steps we will multiply volume of each step by total number of step which is 20 after doing simple calculation we will get volume of all step is 
22.5 cubic feet. Now to determine total volume of staircase, we will add all these volume, which is 50.31 for waist slip, 11.25 for landing, and 22.5 for steps. So total volume of staircase will be equal to 84.06 cubic feet. Now the volume of fit concrete will be equal to total volume of staircase which is equal to 84.06 cubic feet. This is width volume of concrete and to determine the quantity of each material we need to know about dry volume of concrete. Dry volume of concrete can be determined multiplying width volume by 1.54. Here this 1.54 is factor which is used to change wet volume into dry volume. So dry volume of concrete will be equal to 1.54 multiplied by wet volume. Value of wet volume is 84.06 cubic feet. So we will get dry volume of concrete is 129.45 cubic feet. Now we will calculate quantity of each material required for this case like cement, sand and crest stone for which ratio of concrete is needed and it is given that concrete ratio used for this staircase is 1 ratio 2 ratio 4. Sum up ratio will be equal to 1 plus 2 plus 4 which is equal to 7. Now to determine the volume of cement required for this staircase we will use this equation. Volume of cement is equal to ratio of cement multiplied by total volume divided by sum up ratio. Here this one is the ratio of cement, this two is ratio of sand or pine aggregate and this four is ratio of coarse aggregate or crushed stone. Just putting values in this equation, volume of cement will be equal to 1 which is cement ratio multiplied by 129.45 which is total volume divided by sum of ratio which is 7. After doing simple calculation we will get volume of cement is 18.49 cubic feet. We know that volume of one cement bag is equal to 1.25 cubic feet. So number of cement bags will be equal to 18.49 which is volume of cement divided by 1.25 which is volume of one cement bag. After doing simple calculation, we will get 14.79, which is nearly equal to 15 bags. Now we will calculate volume of sand in crust stone. For volume of sand, we will use this equation. Volume of sand is equal to sand ratio multiplied by total volume divided by sum up ratio. Just put values in this equation. We will get volume of sand is equal to 2 multiplied by 129.45 divided by 7. After doing simple calculation, we will get volume of sand is 36.98 cubic feet. Now we will calculate volume of crust stone which is equal to crust stone ratio multiplied by total volume divided by sum up ratio. Volume of crust stone will be equal to 4 multiplied by 129.45 divided by 7. This 4 is the ratio of crust stone. So volume of crust stone will be equal to 73.97 cubic feet. Now we have determined quantity of each material. So abstract of quantities will be like this. Cement required for this staircase is 15 bags. Fine aggregate or sand required for this staircase is 37 cubic feet. Or you can say it 50 cubic feet. And volume of coarse aggregate or crest stone required for this staircase is 74 cubic feet. Or you can say it 100 cubic feet. It was all for today. Thank you very much for watching the video full. For more updated videos about civil engineering, please keep in touch and do subscribe the channel. Thank you very much.